Hey y'all, welcome back to another video on my channel and I'm here to show you how I created this curly look with synthetic hair by boiling it in water. Tune in. <laughs> Alright y'all, this is my boiling hot water and what I'm going to do is sit my wig in that boiling hot water. Now make sure you guys stand clear from the water because this is scalding hot water and it can be dangerous. Now you're just going to find some clamps or either a wooden stick to stick down your wig in the water as much as you can. What it do is make sure the whole wig is hot and have water all over it while it's boiling. So now that we're going to keep poking at it and make sure the water is touching every inch of the wig. Now we're going to lift the wig out and we're going to shake some of the water off. Make sure you have a towel next to your pot. Lay the wig right there on top of your towel. Right, this is my got to be glue styling glue and what you're going to do is add it to the edge of your rat tail comb and we're going to apply it at the end of our molded cap and we're going to do it from the middle all the way down to the side and we're going to do the other side the same exact way and then we're going to make sure that we do a second coat to make sure it's enough on there and it stays glued and stays thick down All right, so now that we got our styling glue on there, we're just gonna take this blow dryer and we're just gonna dry it enough to make it give it that sticky feeling. Don't dry it too much because it'll become very dry and then you're gonna have to add some more. All right, so now we're just gonna tape my wig off the mannequin. Look how beautiful those curls came out to be. Now you guys, I don't had this wig for a long time. I think I done had it for a year and a half. I bought it from my local hair store called Hair Queen. And I haven't used it and I just felt like having curls today. So I brought this wig out of my wig closet. So as you can see, I'm repositioning my wig and I'm finna lay it on top of the sticky part so it can lay down. All right, so now we're just gonna use the blow dryer. And what we're doing is blow drying our lace on top of that styling glue so it can stay tacked down. And also, as you can see, I only blow dry one side of my head because I feel like that part is the most important part that you have to blow dry. Now the other side, you can choose if you wanna blow dry, but usually I just do one side when I boil my wigs. Cause when boiling your wigs, I realize it tightens up your lace and also the whole wig itself. So the other side is not gonna move. So I just glue down that one side good enough so it wouldn't move at all. All right, so I'm still repositioning my wig to give it a better fit. And what I'm doing is using my wide tooth comb as well to style my curls the way I would like. And I'm spreading out my curls in the back, the side, and also on the other side. But as you can see, I'm more focused on my bang because the bang is the most important of your wig. And I'm using my got to be glue to keep it up the way I would like. Freezing in the spot I would like actually. And I'm using my rat tail comb to flatten that top part. This is just the way I would like to style my hair. You guys can style your curls whatever you would like. 